Hello everyone, Tom Pounder here and welcome back for another episode of the Family Chit Chat. Hey, thanks so much for joining me today as we're continuing our look at self-control. Now self-control is choosing to do what you should even when you don't want to. It's choosing to do what you should even when you don't want to. And so there are times when we don't want to do something, but you know by exercising self-control, you should do something different. So it's choosing to do what you should even when you don't want to. And today we're going to talk about our words. See, I want to look at this passage real quick. It's a short verse, but I want to look at it real quick together. Proverbs 12, 18. The words of thoughtless people cut like swords, but the tongue of wise people bring healing. What does this verse mean? I want you to think about this and talk about it right now with your friends and your family. So pause the video, think about it, talk about what the, this verse means, and then we'll come back together. When you're done talking, press play and we'll continue from there. Very simply, thoughtless words hurt people. They bring destruction. They, they cut like a sword. And when a sword cuts you, what does that mean? You're hurting. They're not good. So when you say thoughtless words, it's going to hurt somebody else. But when you have the tongue of a wise person who really thinks before they say something, it brings healing. And that's what our bottom line is today. Choose your words carefully. Choose the words that you say carefully. Don't overreact. Exercise self-control and say what you should, not what you really want to say in the heat of the moment. Say, choose your words carefully and say what is appropriate and bring healing with your words, not hurt. So that is the challenge today. Hey, also, as we kind of wrap up today, I want to look at this verse we've been looking at for the past few weeks. 2 Peter 1.3, God's power has given us everything we need to lead a godly life. Hey, when you think you can't say good words and when you think you can't bring healing with your wise words, Hey, ask God to give you the right words to say because he will bring healing for you. He will bring healing to people and he'll give you the right words to say in those situations. So again, the bottom line for today is choose your words carefully. That's what I want you to focus on today and bring healing with your words, not hurt. All right, as you have stories about this, I would love to hear your thoughts. So if you've used words that have brought healing or hurt, unfortunately, hey, share in the comment section below so we can encourage you today. All right, everyone, well, I hope you have a great rest of the day, and I'll see you next time for a whole new story on self-control. Have a great week.